everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today is another cooking vlog and this time, ang pagbibigyan ko naman is si Claudia. So for my past dishes, laging may pinagbibigyan akong paborito ng mga anak ko. But this dish, which is chicken pastel, is a new favorite of Claudia. Kaya I really had to make the effort to learn how to make it. And this has been the new favorite in the household dahil paulit-ulit itong pinapaluto. Para sa akin, but I want to share it all with you because ang chicken pastel minsan, just like me, parang I get intimidated. I got intimidated. Kala ko napakahirap gawin. Pero hindi naman pala. So I want to share this all with you and that's it. So sharing with all of you the very simple ingredients of chicken pastel. Our very simple ingredients for chicken pastel are chicken thigh filet cut into strips. This is about one and a half kilos. For marinating it, we have calamansi, patis, and pepper. Then of course, for sauteing, we have Maidonia Elena Pure Olive Oil. This is for everyday cooking. I am never without Donya Elena in all of my recipes because I believe in healthy cooking for my children. Donya Elena olive oil, it is loaded with high levels of antioxidants. Like we have vitamins E, K, and A that of course helps lower bad cholesterols. Important for our cooking that we use a good olive oil. And then of course, I have butter. I have garlic minced, onion minced, chicken cube, of course, our salt and pepper. And then we have flour, all-purpose flour. Okay, then we have potatoes cubed, carrots cubed, whole button mushroom. I like keeping it whole. And then any cheese that melts easily. This is about half a bar of a big um, cheese. Hungarian sausage, of course, this is optional. Vienna sausage, I really use that. So you may also use hot dog if you want. And then red and green bell pepper. Optional, of course, is peas. You don't have to put it, pero ako gusto ko, to add color to it. And then we have evaporated milk, or you may use the chicken, the creamy chicken of that. And then we have optional if you want to put some basil leaves. There's so many ways to make chicken pastel. It's really up to you. So ako, I really like putting that Hungarian or shoe but hot dog is also okay. So let's start with marinating. Let's start marinating the chicken. First of all, I want to show you what I mean by chicken thigh filet that I cut into strips. So for other people, they make it into cubes. But I find that pag naluto, na siya masyadong maliit ang cubes. Okay, so we're going to put patis. Para mawala yung dansa ng chicken. Then, lots of kalmansi. See? So, like what I say, I always have kalamansi in my garden. So, nakatanim na yan para madali yan. You know the ingredients that are easy to have? Like for gulay, kompleto yun sa aking garden. I have lahat ng gulay pang pakbel. Meron ako. So, kalamansi, sili, anytime. So, we're just going to marinate this for about 30 minutes. Pwede rin ang hour. Depende sa oras na meron ka. So this has become a favorite sa bahay namin. Minsan talaga, napanghihinaan lang tayo ng loob. And there are a lot of viewers of this channel. You write comments and you tell me na hindi talaga kayo cook. But it looks so easy naman when, when you watch me do it. So I just need you to know na all you have to really do is to take that first step and choose recipes na konti lang at very basic yung mga ingredients. And practice na lang when no one's watching. <laughs> Para hindi ka intimidate You just need to know that once you really start cooking, especially for your family, and especially for special occasions, it feels so rewarding. Kasi na, na, na papaligayan niyo yung mga mahal niyo sa buhay. So to marinate it, it's patis, calamansi, and pepper. Okay? So those who always watch my channel, you know how much I love massaging, or I was corrected, rubbing the chicken. 
favorite part ko to, marinating chicken, okay? So after you do this, you just leave it there. We'll use it later. We will first saute yung mga kailangan natin sa ating chicken pastel. Here you go. We'll leave this here and we will begin. Okay, so we're going to start sauteing our ingredients. Okay, first of all, while we are marinating our chicken with patis, calamansi, and pepper, I'm going to start with my Doña Elena pure olive oil. Okay, there is a wrong notion about using olive oil. Okay, we think that when you buy this masyadong expensive, wrong. This Doña Elena olive oil is not expensive if you are going to compare it with the health benefits. Remember all the vitamins na nakukuha natin from this olive oil. And you know, if you are a viewer, that I have always been using it. As a matter of fact, I have three variants of that. Okay, people know, every time I roast and I fry, I use pomas. See? And when I use salads, when I make sandwiches, or when I cook my Filipino dishes, tapos nilalagyan ko siya to top it extra virgin oil. We are going to fry our potatoes. I'm going to first saute the potatoes and the carrots because it's hard to get it. So I want to get it in Just for three minutes, let's cook it. So I'm just going to put some pepper and a little bit of salt. Okay? It's just easy because I don't cook it for later. Eh. Okay? The thing about chicken pastel because you can cook it in two ways. You can serve as is or you can put your puff pastry on top. Yon masarap yon. Just stay naman I will show you that option later. But for now, ito muna yun. Okay? We will set that aside. So, wag na muna ang tanggalin yung nalagyan nyo. Alam mo, sa kakaluto ko nitong chicken pastel, hindi na ako na-intimidate, hindi na ako nahihirapan. Kala mo na marami siyang ingredients, pero sa totoo lang, pagsaka lang ng pagsa. Now, he loves this. So there was a time that I cooked it for four straight days. Love the colors of carrots and potato. In the meantime, we are not wasting any time while doing this because we're not marinating. So after we palambot for about, I think I did a little bit more, a little bit more than three minutes. I'm going to set this aside. While I'm doing that, I'm going to make sure na the marinade ko is evenly distributed. Let's saute the Hungarian sausage. So in our house, we always have Shublig sausage, Hungarian sausage. I buy this in the grocery store or Sankis. We always have this, okay? Ito yung ating bigla, ating biglaan na we don't know what to eat, we will have Hungarian sausage. That's why I'm adding it also here. Okay, so I think it's cooked already, half cooked. We're going to use the same oil, okay, that had our potatoes, that had our carrots, and even some of the flavor of the Hungarian sausage. And I will put my butter. I will add my onions. With the onset, I use my other arm. I will put my garlic. Now, this is me, okay? Some people put their chicken cube pag may sauce na sila. It's been my habit, and dito comfortable that I put my chicken cube one bowl habang nag-sauce ako. Again, the chicken because we don't want the marinade. Wow, multi-toxic. What? Yeah, but I'm going to see mommy. Hindi, hindi, hindi. Kasi baka masunog yung garlic. I'm draining it. We don't like naman the patis and all of that to go into the Sorry. Okay, now I'm going to put the chicken. You get it? 
Okay, this is the oil, and then the sibuyas, the garlic, the butter, the butter. and then there's pepper in there. Yeah, my pepper na rin kasi yung aking chicken, right? So we're going to saute this and simmer. Let it simmer for about 10 minutes. I'm going to cover it. Let's let our chicken simmer before we put all our other ingredients, okay? Now, there was a mistake I made the second time I tried it. Hindi siya masyadong malapot. Masyado siyang maliquid. So, this time while today, I'm going to put some flour. Okay, para lang mag-thicken. So, I just put the flour and then I'll continue to simmer it before we put all the other ingredients. Okay? Itong evap ko to, this is like the chi chi chicken creamy evap. This is one tetra pack. Yeah. So, tamang tama siya for my recipe. So, I'm going part because I'm fixed. <laughs> <laughs> here. The reason for now you can include the reason blood. for me learning how to make chicken pastel is oh, here we did it now. Yeah, I love it. So, when you go it. home. Wow. Yeah, so she's the main reason. So, I was much intimidated to cook, right? And then yeah. you said, you can do it, mom. Yeah, because it's just, you just have to try it. Yeah, so have to try I it. learned it for her. And it's worth it. Everyone who's tried it only says good things about yeah. it. Yeah. So. Why complicated with food? Um, it's not diet food, it's like special food. Yes. Yeah. Okay, I'm going to put the carrots and the potatoes. Okay, so I have already put my evap. Okay, I used one tetra pack. Ang ganda, oh. It's so nice. Now, I'm going to put the Hungarian sausage. You see, I told you once it's cooked, papasok mo lang yung papasok yung mga ano mo, eh. Ingredients mo. See, Leon, it's nice. Oh, it's nice. It's malapot na. And then, hindi pa tayo tapos. Don't forget, we have our cream pack. Okay? What kind of so, cream? we have the evap all-purpose cream. I'm going to put my mushroom. You know this? Why do I do this? I'm more comfortable. I get so tired from this and that. So everything that I cook, I do. And I use my favorite kitchen pro. This is the time. Remember, I'm going to put my chicken cube. So this is the time to season. Now, I don't want to put too much salt because I have chicken cube. And I'm going to put cheese. Diba? So, but then again, titikman na lang natin. Para alam natin. So, we're gonna let it cook for a bit. I'm gonna put my Vienna sausage. Bagsak-bagsak na lahat. And this is yung sinasabi ko sa inyo, optional. Okay, I put basil leaves a little bit. Optional yan. Whatever spice you want to put, bahala kayo. But if your kids don't like mga ganyan, okay lang lang. Look at all the colors that it has, diba? Because I said optional rin, na Sabi ko, lagyan natin ng peace. I just want them to see the difference. Yeah. Ang ganda lang. Look at this, so cute. Free taste testing talaga yan. I don't know, I found this in a Japanese store. And I said, pwede to ah, parang hindi ko na i-dip. <laughs> How's it? Perfect! Ako, just ko. Kung ma-explain. It's so good. Okay, I'll still put the cheese, ha? Pero masarap siya. It's so tama na! <laughs> I want you to taste it, Leon. I think this is my best version. Mm -hmm. This is my best version. Okay, I'm going to cover this and let it simmer. You know, I'm loving the taste of um, the green and red bell pepper. In this meal, we get to make them eat chicken. They get to eat potato, carrots, red and green bell pepper. Please, hindi nila alam. Masarap na siya. What's this one? Okay, this is the pastry puff. Okay, so version number one, chicken pastel. Ready for parties. Version number two, I'm going to attempt to make puff pastry, okay? Itong puff pastry na bibili to sa frozen, gross, frozen area ng groceries or Claudia bought this for me, actually. Sa kagustuhan niya, matuto akong magluto ng chicken pastel. She taught me how to make it. 
So I preheated the oven to 350 degrees Fahrenheit. So I'm just gonna let it heat first. Now we're going to do this, okay? Slightly beaten, no, beaten egg. Here, just slightly beaten, bread pudding pala yun. A little bit of that. Okay, the I'm gonna stretch it. I'm going to connect it. Now. Connect it. Masarap kasi to eh. Ito yung perfect siya sa taste ng the crunch. The crunch. Wait. The crunch and the texture in the mouth. Crunch and the texture. Ang ginawa nila. <laughs> Pinasok nila. Your fork. I my kids laugh at me. Your ah. fork strategy. I did a fork strategy. That's good too. But I also saw this. Pinch. 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 You know this puff pastry, but hindi niya mabilis sa grocery. You can make it on your own, and you can watch the other vlogs. They know how to make. They'll teach you how to make the pastry at home. Okay, and then I'm going to put this. This is the egg, beaten egg, and a little bit of evap para magiging golden brown. Siya. Okay, so ever since I discovered this puff pastry, I make na kung ano ano. I put cream cheese or the favorite. Chocolate of Erich. Tapos pinipake ng konte para na siyang may croissant croissant. Now, let's make butas para lumabas yung... I don't know kung lalabas. <laughs> <laughs> kung wala kayong mga Hungarian sausage, you can put ham. You can put hot dog. And actually, anything you want to put. Just don't forget the chicken. Kasi nga, chicken. How about spam? Wait! Spam? For vegetarians, you can make it vegetable pastel. Puro. Yeah, for carrots, potatoes, string beans, corn, can be anything. I'm gonna put it for about 15 minutes, huh? To check ko mama ya. Oh, I'm so pressured. I hope I don't disappoint you guys. Let's see. Okay. There is our chicken pastel with pastry puff. So, should we try it, Leon? Go. Okay, so I'm so proud. <laughs> Proud of myself. I love it. Sabi ni Leon. Put it here, put it here, kakain na. Look at that. Chicken pastel. Ooh yeah. la la. Your children will love this. Look at the crust. I'm so proud because of the pro love the crust. So thank you. Oh, sorry, my visita ko. <laughs> So anyway, I want to thank all of you for joining me again. And I hope you will enjoy this new recipe or this new dish. My son is still laughing. <laughs> that you can definitely, definitely serve for special occasions. So, see you again next week. Bye!